Okay, now I want you to imagine that you are the sun. I want you to kind of shine the light in different directions. We developed a device called the Light Sound that essentially takes light and converts it to sound as a tool for the blind and visually impaired. There's a light sensor on the back, so essentially it's measuring the brightness of light as it changes during the eclipse, as the moon eclipses the sun. In 2017, I just distinctly remember feeling really left out. Um, I actually have this memory of feeling a little bit resentful <laughs> that I couldn't be a part of this eclipse in some way. So one option, you can hook this up to a speaker and then you can project the sound to an entire group. So we can kind of, as the sun is changing, this would be like, the bright light of the sun, and then as it starts to dim, it goes away and the sound kind of gets lower. And then the shadow comes in and it gets even lower and starts clicking. Even though we can't see something, it doesn't mean that we can't experience something. Um, you know, we have a lot of different senses and different ways of um, enjoying different experiences um, and just because it's different doesn't mean that it's not worthwhile. It's going to be inclusive and having any technology that makes it possible for us to have an experience, an actual experience rather than somebody simply describing it to us is always fantastic. Just a few steps to building the devices. Um, we just have three components that we solder on, a light sensor, a MIDI board, which is where we uh, assign the sounds, or the instruments, I guess, and then the, the main microcontroller board where the code sits. Um, and once you solder that on, then we're ready to do a sound check. So we you know, attach a battery, plug in the headphones, and check to make sure it's working or troubleshoot. Um, luckily, today, we've built a bunch, and they haven't had any major problems. I'm very excited about it. I'm definitely going to be a part of it this year.